What it do, ladies and gentlemen? I want to give a big shout out to Kenny. He locked in the Black Tri Mail at 350. I have two spots left for the Black Tri one for the Black Tri, one for the Blue Tri, 400 apiece. I'm going back down to 300 for both of them for one person. But the catcher is I get first and third pick. That's the catcher. So for two people, I have it for 300 on the blue try and the black try, but I get first and third pick. Um, big shout out to Kenny. Thank you, sir, for locking them in. These dogs right here are, they're going on eight months old. Um, so they are super small. I, like I said, the whole litter was very consistent. Everybody was small. The little Red Bull clone that I had that I sold to my man up in Boston, he was, a, come here, boy. He was a little bit bigger um than these guys but not much um plus you know i already have that color um through red bull so i figured you know they're clones no need to keep them let me let him go um this little guy right here reminds me a lot of mars um he's he's definitely going to be shorter you can tell look at him look, look at the di difference in heights um, so he's definitely going to be smaller, you know, since they're pushing eight months, bro, they're probably going to grow a maximum, a maximum of a half inch. You know, they're not going to grow much taller at all. You know, my dogs, you know, I know every dog's different, you know, even in, even in the same breed. Um, uh, every bloodline's different, sorry. Um, you know, with growth rate, but what I've noticed with my dogs, right around eight months, they stop growing. Um... Now, they put on a whole lot more mass. I can see his muscles coming out right here. This little blue male. You can see him. Look, look. Look at his neck. You can see him coming out. Um, so, you know, what I've realized is, you know, they put on more muscle and mass, you know, um, after that, of course. Um, but as far as height, dude, they're done. Uh, what else? What else? You can text me at 270-317-1952. I accept the, the money through cash app only. Um, they'll be ready to be bred here in, here in a couple months. You know, if you, you got a female coming in, you know, towards the end of spring, summer, they'll be ready. Um, maybe even a little bit before that, but I'm just, you know, for sure, they'll be ready by the later dates. Um, uh, what else? Uh, oh, their bloodline, their brothers. Their bloodline consists of... Uh, Grand Champion El Toro, that's Red Bull's daddy, which is their dad. Uh, Grand Champion Dirty Bird. Um, 2X Grand Champion Futuristic, which Red Bull's mother was an inbred uh, Grand Champion Futuristic daughter. Um, uh, he bred uh, Grand Champion Futuristic to his granddaughter. Um, the granddaughter's daddy is Grand Champion Dirty Bird. Um, that's all uh, Red Bull's mother's side of the pen their their daddy's side now their mother's side is a grand champion trumper daughter her name is savage she's one of the best females on my yard um you know both of them complement each other very well they're both short back they're both very short they both carry great muscle definition uh red bull probably has the best feet on my yard as a male um he definitely has the shortest back um he definitely has the widest chest savage has a ridiculous chest so um so yeah, uh, oh, uh, great news! When I bred Mister Forty Five to um, Furiosa, which is uh, uh, Savage's niece, which is uh, Roy Zarelli's daughter, uh, I bred her to Mister Forty Five. She is prego. Uh, C-section date is Friday next week, so I, she's already sold. Um, I already sold her. Uh, I may have some puppies available off that, depending on how many I have. So I'm not advertising any pups on that. I just wanted to. Shout that out that she is prego, so I'm super excited, super happy. Um, look at that muscle, bro. Look at the muscles, dude. Look at that height. But anyways, but this little black tri male, he's no joke, bro. He's got a little chest on him. He's got some nice paws. You know, I'm really excited for both of them. Um, I was thinking about selling the black male, uh, I want to say maybe a couple weeks to a month ago. I'm glad I changed my mind because he is beautiful. Um, he has the exact same paint job as Grand Champion Il Toro. Um... These black tries, well, all tries, they can come in different color tan points. Um, they can be darker, they can be lighter, they can be in the middle. If you look at him, his is light. You look at him, his is in the middle. Then you also have dark tan points. A lot of Rockwallers, you know, you can see them in the Rockwallers. They're like dark brown. So I'm just super excited, man, to uh, 
to have produced these two crazy phenomenal males. But with that being said, Greg Bullet Camp Baby signing off.